welcome back to another fantastic episode of Game. To my left, the son of Jarrell himself, Simon Says. And to my right, Big Pimp and Jay. The mighty Mega Sean, how you doing today? Oh, man? I'm doing fantastic. Not as good as a man drinking out of a bottle, out of a mug. To the Ebola thing, man. I'm just, you know. Yeah, you got to keep. Double bag it, You got to quarantine. You got to quarantine. Of course, I am Mega Sean. Today, we're going to discuss Hollywood career suicide and, the act, and some of the actors that are responsible. Of course, also hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Gmail at GameshowChat at gmail.com. Fellas, game on. Nick Cage. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. sorry. Anything that Nick <laughs> Cage does yeah. nowadays is it, 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 just god awful. Even the little like spoofs that he does yeah. are terrible, man. I, look, I, I would not touch Nick Cage with your junk in him pushing at this point. <laughs> it is that bad. Would, <clears throat> would he have been possible to ruin the Superman franchise as a whole had that he, happened. He, listen, yeah. listen, he would have done to the Superman franchise what Tyler Perry has done to Black Seminole. Oh. He just set it back like 35 years. Oh. It, it, he just, he, he would have wrecked it. He would have killed it. It, it would have been it, oh. just terrible. Tyler. You, you would have rather seen a seven foot proctologist, right? With them big old hands, demon, right? Then see Nick Cage as Superman. That dude, and the sad thing is, the dude won an Oscar. I have no idea. I, I can't quite pinpoint. It, it was sometime. How was that possible? It was sometime after like Con Air and Face Off that he went from like hero to oh good God make it stop. I don't know what happened. But dude is just he's just he's a, he's he, he is a shell of his former self, a complete and utter farce. And I just I just too. But now is it just that maybe the public has just the movie watching the public has just gotten tired because in the majority he's been the same like if you were to go back and watch something <laughs> now it might have, now maybe his cast was different but you know he uh, uh, you know he, he always like he's nick well, cage well you remember we went to go see that movie that horrible movie with nick cage watch in it your mouth. i'm not gonna say it but just remember <clears throat> we we fell asleep in that movie, <laughs> that movie so that was that bad it was that hey, it was which, which movie was that well, no, no, okay. don't worry about it. Don't worry okay. about it. Don't, hey. It was Ghost Rider. Oh! oh. I want to oh. mm. hey, We fell asleep on it. Can I get some bourbon in this? Now that I think about it, maybe that was the... No, no, it was, no, no, it was, no, long, it was, it was, it was long before hey, that. I, I agree with you. I, I don't... Look, I think... Here's what happened. Nick Cage must have made a deal with the devil. Because the dude can't act. And the contract was up. And then the contract was up. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, no, nah, man, we ain't taking you, man. You just have to suffer through this. Yeah. I mean, uh, apparently his, you know, you know, Francis Ford Coppola uncle stuff kind of ran out. Because yeah. they just neglected that dude. Yeah. Somewhere along the line, he just... Yeah. I feel bad for the dude. It's pretty bad. <clears throat> It's pretty bad. I mean, and I I enjoyed National Treasure, but it was because it was Nick Cage. Like, I, I enjoyed National Treasure despite Nick Cage. Well, yeah, well, <laughs> yeah. That know, movie yeah. was tolerable despite him being yeah. in it. Now, what about um, what about Holly Berry? Oh. Mm. Listen, Holly Berry went from being a great actress. Was she? Holly Berry was <laughs> being a serviceable <laughs> actress. actress. <laughs> <laughs> to me, if you look at the greats, there's a timeline of there's, there's a consistency. The greatness, yeah. There's your Morgan Freeman. Right. There's your When I first met Anthony Dufresne. Yes. You know, it's, it's <laughs> consistency. Yes. There's your Tim Robbins. Yes. And then there's everybody else. And then and then but what I what I think is that those those greats who realize what they are and aren't forced to do other films, they just take a back seat. I, you, you see here, here's the thing. Tim I, Robbins is, he, he's kind of falling back. <sighs> Whereas De Niro, but he's Pacino, not career suicide yet. It's not the point where he's like poisonous to touch. Well, but that's because he just pops in and he's never starring. It's like you're watching a movie of actors you respect and like. Oh wow, Tim Robbins is in this, as opposed to this more movie like starring a, Tim Robbins. Yeah, more like a cameo than the actual. He's in the actual movie. Exactly. But exactly. but I I would say and not not as a, you know just you know because uh, what happened to one actor, but uh, I'm gonna say I must say Johnny Death just for the fact that. Ar the the Lone Ranger, Army Hammer's career is it, pretty much done. Who? See, you don't know because you haven't seen it, but you know what I'm Wait, talking I mean, about. Who, really who's Army Hammer? Like, I mean, obviously, as a. Is, like, like, is, like, is, is Armin Hammer that stuff I buy and put in the fridge? <laughs> no, no, no. No. I mean, I can't say too much as a struggling actor <laughs> myself, but he. I mean, he never he really. He was outshadowed, had. but he was outshadowed. <laughs> he was supposed to be the star. He was outshadowed by Mark. By, uh, what is that boy's name? His name isn't Mark Zuckerberg. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Jesse Eisenberg. He was outshadowed by him. Oh, and, then, and, it, yeah. and if you allow yeah. Jesse Eisenberg to outshadow you, 
know, that's kind of. It's like, for example, obvious. you look at, look at Paul Walker and look at Vin Diesel. Like, Vin Diesel wasn't even the star of that movie, but he jettisoned <laughs> himself. Technically, wouldn't a Paul didn't, Walker be Hollywood suicide? Wow. Well, I, no, I, I, was, I was saying, no, no, Vin Diesel would be Hollywood suicide because Paul Walker can't do anything other than, oh, than uh, Fast oh, and Furious. Oh, 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 hold on, man. Didn't Vin Diesel, wasn't he just in a movie that made like 60 gajillion dollars for saying three words? I am groomed. Excuse That's, me, four? Right. I mean, that was his voice. But it's still, it's still him. But I mean, but uh, but I think like that, as far as in regards to Army Hammer, I don't ever think he had. Now that movie, I don't, I don't think he did either. As a whole, the Lone Ranger, I don't care who was in it. I, it Johnny Depp took a step back. He's like, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't have did that one. Well, Johnny yeah, Depp really hasn't done a, a, a good movie in probably a good ten years. I mean, the first Pirates movie was good. We're just we'll wait to see to that. Well, he's supposed to be doing another Pirates movie. <sighs> that too, but uh, then, he's but, also but, in another um, another project coming up as well. But I mean, I, I, I think after that movie, he realized like, okay, yeah, I can't just make. Anything. Is Johnny well, Depp I mean, is, is Johnny Depp Hollywood suicide, or is he just one of those guys who is willing to prostitute himself out for whatever the big money is? Oh no, I don't even. Well, he did. What was it like? What was it like? That was his third Disney movie or fourth Disney movie because I mean Disney writes huge checks. They do, and I would have just kind of like passed on that whole Tonto thing if I was him. Why not? He listen, have. listen, man. He probably listen. recommended the actual Native they American. They gave like twenty some million dollars, man. That's twenty million reasons to say, sure, I'll put on some face no paint. No doubt about it. Okay, but, good. No doubt about it. But, but I, I think, think he should have passed on it, though. Well, yeah, cause, but but with with Depp though, he'll choose some obscure roles every now and, and then. And normally he pulls right. off. I mean, exactly. I mean, you know, and he, I think he, this he a, didn't work. He's had a great career from like you know Edward Scissorhands to uh, from Hell. I thought you know was was a, re, it. a real underrated movie. I enjoyed it. Donnie um, Brasco. Yeah. Yeah, that was a very exactly. good movie. Now, what, what if instead of um, Army Hammer, I think the movie would have worked better. Well, had the movie just been better, and I haven't even watched the movie yet. But had it been better. I think it, had they put him as the Lone Ranger as opposed to him playing I a Native American. I would have rather seen from, Roland, personally. Or yeah. th anybody. But I, but I think from that standpoint, you know, it was kind of, because you had that whole red skin thing starting to build back up, and then it's like Johnny Depp's playing Tonto. That's more whitewashing of the you know, Hollywood yeah. movies. Right, but that's another that's topic a whole for another day. But what about, uh, I'll say Owen Wilson. You think I, he's career oh, suicide? Owen, Owen Wilson and Vince Vaughn are, 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 are Hollywood suicide version 1.0. So we're quickly getting to 2.0 with, with James Franco and Seth yeah, Rogen. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, that's that that whole apto. That, 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 <laughs> that, 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 that whole group is starting to. Although in all fairness, man, that fight scene in the first Anchor Man was absolutely hysterical. It was. It Speaking was. of Tim Robbins, it was. Yeah, doing see, but you see, he yeah. just you jump in, you jump out. Yeah. See, I mean, o o Owen Wilson to me, um, he's he, he's a one character actor. He's kind of like Will Smith. He's always the same guy in every movie. But not even as good as Will Smith. He doesn't. He's, he doesn't bring the energy oh. that that Will would. I'll Owen, give, I'll give you that. He's Owen, and, well, you know, and then he tries time. to, you know, and he tries to, you know, so, so then we're gonna talk, and then we're gonna, we're gonna and then we're gonna laugh. Yeah. He's, he's the same he, and then the nose over and over still kind of throws. He's, he, yeah. he's almost Mark Mark Wahlberg-ish as far as but, but, what's uh, going on. Who are you doing? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that, it, Owen Wilson. I don't. There's something about him and his brother Luke who who drives me up a freaking and wall. And are aging well. Well, you know, most white dudes, they hit like 27 and that, then they well, fall off a cliff. that's how you feel. I'm not going to argue. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's, that's just, you know, I, you know he, it's just, yeah, it's... Uh, you want to yeah. bring up suicide? Uwe Boll. Correct. Director. A anybody Correct. who's been in a movie with him has not been seen since. Wrong. You are <laughs> wrong there, my friend. I am? Yes. There is actually one person who survived. Who survived? Yes, Jason Statham survived it. Oh, yes, you're right. He you was in right. that god-awful dragon slayer yeah. quest. He did something. He came, something. But he came out with some wounds, but he survived. But now, who made all that House of the Dead? Oh, uh huh. A... Let that sink in for a minute. But you spent money and time of your life that you wish you could have had both back to see that movie. Well, now, in regards, you bring up Statham. Not he's not career suicide yet, but he has plummeted. You know, he was the transporter. Like, did he do too many transporters? Because you know, like he was two or three. Yeah, he was at a height. I think, he got, and well, now he's like doing B movies. But but like his characters are the same. Yeah, I got, he got typecast. It's, it's the same character. I got who it is. I got who the suicide is, and I think she might have brought Statham down. Jennifer Lopez. They were in that movie well, together. Wait, 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 he went. Wait, wait, he's been down wait, wait, ever since. Wait 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 wait. wait. <clears throat> Uwe Boll, bad director. Yeah. Right. Right. Nick Cage, bad actor. Jennifer Lopez. 
is she an actress? Yeah. Dancer, singer. I, I mean, what? I, I don't. What I, don't I don't think she can act. I mean, has she really ever acted in anything? She's uh, attractive, and she's got uh, certain assets that well, have not became popular. So does Megan Fox, but she can't act either. She doesn't have the assets, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't have the assets. <laughs> I think you know what? You may be out of something that anything that touches Jennifer Lawrence. Um, ben Affleck included. Jennifer. Lopez. Oh, Lopez. Sorry, sorry. Let's not please. do that to Cagney Severdeen now. Okay. Please. Apologize <laughs> to your community. Please. <laughs> okay. For, forgive me. I had a moment of, of unclarity. There's too much something in here. Um, forgive me, please. Anytime Jennifer Lawrence wants to come by, I promise I will never kick you out of bed for eating cookies. Okay. <laughs> and you're also welcome to the set of game as well. Just, yes. just, just putting it out there. Um, no, Jennifer Lopez, I mean, the, the girl can't act. I mean, granted, it's a great story of how she got there. And again, I wouldn't touch her with your junk and him pushing either. You're absolutely right. She's just absolutely she terrible. She is career suicide. The guy who she did enough with hasn't been seen again. Look at Ben Affleck. Almost wrecked his career until he got on board with another Jennifer. Well, almost, get, killed get, yeah. almost killed his career. Almost killed his career. But then he's also been out. I guess when you can write yourself back in, you're kind of good. And he, the people wanted to give him a shot because he had an Oscar as with um, Nicolas Cage. Let's... Okay, well, we'll see if he can bring himself back. Ben decided to, and now the guy's Batman. But now that I think about it, Jennifer Lopez, Statham, Affleck, and then he the said, guy who didn't blow up off of enough. That could have uh, been because he, of how good he played a, a woman uh, beater, but, uh, you know. No, I was thinking of uh, Benjamin Bratt, but I don't know if she uh, really... She really... Holly Berry, Catwoman, Benjamin, Benjamin Bratt, Bratt, downhill. Damn. The seven degrees of suicide. <laughs> wow. Ube, Nick... Oh, yeah. Uh, Holly, Lopez, wow, that's that's a uh, oof, and and yeah. I mean literally they haven't none of them have really worked and like Jason your, was rising. What about your double just, uh, Mars Chetnut? Uh, oh wow, that's no, no need to be disrespectful to me. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> well, I, I said he was your stunt double. Right, you did say that. You did say that. He you was did your stunt that. double. Yes. Um, mm. Wait, can you pull out the wheelchair tricks? <laughs> I don't think. Uh, <laughs> The last project he was in was well, with Holly Berry, Berry. No, but that was with that was, WWE money too, though. No, so. the, the, I think yeah. the, the last the last thing I think I saw him in was that ill-fated V. Oh, here we go. Well, Speaking of V, yeah. Summer Glau. Oh wow. Well, she yeah, she kind of so, almost almost anything that Summer Glau has ever touched, almost anything, gets canceled. Remember, almost every TV show, she was on Dollhouse, canceled. canceled. Put on Firefly, yeah, canceled. canceled. Yeah. Terminator, canceled. What about she survived uh, Arrow? Cape. Cape, uh, Cape done. Done. It was like done. four episodes and yep. gone. Yep, done. Now, question. She's the epitome. Who was responsible for the suicide of Sam Worthington? The man had movies. Oh, yes. Oh, that, and that, and then that, next that, thing I know, he's next to Arnold in a B movie in that sabotage. That would have been his cocaine habit, actually. No. Oh, I have no idea, man. What does that happen? <laughs> it, it could have. It could have. Yeah, it, suicide it, itself. It, wow. But I mean, I, these people are just, like, he was... He was, yeah, he was, uh, took a yeah, dive. Yeah, yeah. It's it's it, it, it's funny how it happens where people. I mean, again, once you reach that peak, like like Jim Carrey, he reached that twenty million dollar deal, and next thing you know, you don't want to touch him. You don't want to see him in anything. Yeah. So I mean, you know, you know, be careful that that once you reach that pinnacle of Hollywood money, that man, the only way you got to go is down. Now, <laughs> real quick, you know, yes or no, could certain sequels be considered career suicide? Because I think about Sam Worthington once he did that second. <laughs> Yeah, Clash of Titans. Yeah, no. yeah, it just, it, it, it just it, yeah. yeah okay. The a, hair was weird. He's a man. Yeah. yeah. So, what do you think about that? I, you, you know, I, I, I think when you start delving into bad story writing and bad directing, no doubt about uh, it. You know, you really start getting into the problems. I mean, you can almost get to the point where, you know, I don't want to say Kevin Spacey's career suicide because he's a great actor, but he's starting to take lesser and lesser and more terrible well, roles. That's why he ever did the Call of Duty. He knows. Spacey yeah. realizes yeah. it. Let me get this Call of Duty money, you sir, real quick. Uh, I would say like uh, Johnny Depp. The sequels that he's doing, they kind of, they, they kind of, he's kind of, they kind of like. On if the, he does a Lone Ranger two, burn the theater down. But, oh, yeah. but, but see, let's face it, there's very few good sequels, anyways. Yeah. So, yeah. for game, we have Big Pimp and Jay. We have here the. <laughs> I am Mega Sean. Hit us up on all social media outlets. We're everywhere except LinkedIn. Talk to you later. <laughs>